The A's ballpark bill has passed the Nevada legislature. Hello and thanks for joining us tonight live at 11. I'm Trisha Keen. As we get ready for another championship parade, another sports team is one step closer to playing ball right here in Southern Nevada. Our Brian Horwath has more on today's decision. Earlier on Wednesday, the Nevada legislature signed off on the Oakland A's ballpark bill, which paves the way for Las Vegas to very likely get a Major League Baseball team. The bill now only needs a signature from Governor Joe Lombardo to become law. After a green light vote in the Nevada Senate on Tuesday, the assembly voted 25 to 15 for the stadium bill after introducing some changes. One of those is a stipulation that the A's must give $2 million per year to go toward community programs in the Las Vegas Valley once the ballpark opens. MLB owners will need to sign off on the A's move to Las Vegas, but that's expected to happen. Assemblyman Ruben De Silva was one of the lawmakers who voted for the bill, and he says he's excited that the A's will likely come here. This is a monumental, really, uh, a moment in, uh, in Nevada sports history, but we also wanted to make sure that we were making the right decision for the state. So uh, going in uh, into today, uh, there was a lot of uncertainty. Following the assembly vote, Nevada state senators had to then sign off again on the bill because of the amendment that was introduced. That happened Wednesday evening at about 6 o'clock. Assuming Lombardo signs Senate Bill 1 soon, the next step would be for Major League Baseball to approve a move by the A's to Las Vegas. The A's hope to begin play in the new ballpark in 2028. Reporting from the studio tonight, I'm Brian Horwath. Brian, thank you. And the Oakland A's released a statement regarding this decision. It reads in part, quote, we are grateful for the legislator's time and dedication to shepherding this bill through the process, including this special session. We look forward to Governor Lombardo's signature as our next step, end quote. And we will continue to follow the very latest developments on this bill.